All right, explain to us, what are you doing here, Sandy? I'm taking care of the dog. No, no, no. This is your project. This is, uh, you designed this, uh, so this if it a, fails, it's your fault. Yes, you got it. You got it. Make sure you get down And we got the workforce there, Sam. Oh, what we're going to do here, we've got horrible, horrible clay. Percolation really is bad. And believe it or not, we got some gophers in here, and I don't know how they get through the clay, but they did. This was our tomato area, and last year the, the gophers got it. So the plan is to dig it all up, and I'm going to go down as deep as I can, and then mix in chips with the clay, and then chips on top of the clay, and then do about 16 inches of soil on top of the chips. And the chips, hopefully, are going to act as sort of a drainage area. So that's the plan. We'll see what it ends up looking like. All right, I'm bringing out the big guns for this one. Heavy artillery time. I have excavated a small swimming pool. All right. This is our idea of a gopher resistant enclosure. Oh, you have your camera. Always got my camera, Doug. Oh, I hope this works. I put a whole bunch of mixture of chips and some of the clay in there. I'm going to level it out and push it up against the edges. And then I'm going to put a layer of chips and then the, the last 12 to 14 inches is going to be decent topsoil for growing in. And I'm putting a mixture of some really high-end compost with the uh, old soil. I put the compost on top of it and I'm going to till it all together and bring in some probably some chicken manure and we'll see what happens. What do you think Doug? Well we can level this and then we'll try this stuff. Well I don't know if we need to. Okay. Well, I have no there is there is such a thing as overkill. Really? <laughs> you ever seen Caddyshack? <laughs> Alright I've brought in bucket loads of chips. I've got it within about Oh, 12 inches of the surface. I'm expecting it to compress. I've got the bobcat over there and I'm going to bring in all that soil over there and spread it out on top of the chips. Now the theory is that the edging here is going to minimize the gophers and the chips may also help, but the chips are more for drainage because we're on top of solid clay here. Look at that. It was an impossible situation to grow in. I dug down at least 36 inches and it was solid clay. Nothing percolated through here, so we shall see. There it is. Now all we have to do is put boards up around it and we're going to put uh, the rabbit wire like we have to in the rest of our yard. And we got a whole new planting area. I like it. Good job, Doug. Good job.